basically says, listing agents, you must disclose when marketing the property, but that is a short sale. Even if the seller says, don't tell them, they'll find out when we get an escrow, don't put it in the MLS, don't tell them, you have to market it as a short sale if it's a short sale, which, is, which means you must check that mandatory box in the MLS, or if it's a non-MLS listing, you must, if you advertise it, you must advertise it as a short sale. You can't wait until you get an escrow and the buyer to realize, oh my goodness, it's a short sale. They have to be able to know, and this is, a, this is historic. First time that California has ever mandated a pre-escrow disclosure. All the other things you have to disclose, like the TDS and all that stuff, you don't really have to disclose it until you actually have a buyer. This is sort of pre-buyer. You can't hide the fact that it's a short sale. But what if the seller says, it's not really a short sale. I mean, I owe 500, the house is worth 480. Yeah, I'll list it 480, but if I don't get an offer, if I can't sell it for 480, I'll make up the difference. I'll bring cash in myself, I won't make sure it's a Of course, that's not good enough. If the listed price is less than 